Hello friends, I am Binoy. Welcome to my YouTube channel, Share Tips. Today, again, I am talking about our favorite stocks, RVNL. Two reasons are there. So many of my subscribers call me and request me to put another video on RVNL. At the same time, everyone is confused whether to book profit or will now whether there will be correction happens in RVNL. So many questions are there. Above that, there is a news which I heard on Friday about RVNL, a fantastic news. So I like to share that news also with all of you, all of my subscribers. First of all, whether RVNL stock is now to sell or buy. That's a great question asked by so many of my subscribers. It's very difficult to give a proper answer for that. So that's upon your discretion. Actually, I am a, a fundamental analyst. I study a company in detail. And if I find this company can able to give a good return in future, can show consistent at profit for the next five years, I recommend this stock blindly because it's a fundamentally good company, you will not lose your capital. And, and, and I fix their target. From 30 onwards, I fix my target to 200. After that, I my enhance my target to 400. And again, I enhance my target to 500. From the time being, while considering the fundamentals of the company, my target for RVL is 1000 rupees. So whether it's correct or not is a very difficult to answer. Sometimes the in between 460 to the last trader price is 460 from 460 to 1000 rupees. There may be ups and downs. There may be resistance. There may be support. Actually, I'm not uh, a technical analyst, so I don't know about that. So you can consult a technical analyst also to, in order to uh, whether to sell or buy a share. It's a present rate. What is the rate to sell? What is the rate to accumulate? That I don't know. But regarding on or basis on the fundamentals of the company, RVN will definitely go to 1000 rupees. That's the reason I am going to share with all of you now. On Friday, I heard a news that the company has incorporated subsidiary naming RVNL Middle East Contracting LLC in Dubai. This is a highlight of what I like about RVNL. When I first talking about RVNL, I always said that Arvin is getting orders from abroad also, not from Indian companies. That is a highlighted point regarding Arvin. So in order to execute these all orders, they desire to form a subsidiary in Dubai. It's a very highlighted point. Dubai is uh, developing day by day and Arvin is expecting to get orders from Dubai from other countries also. Again, I said that Arvin is, is, is not a mere company compared with the railway stocks just like uh, Urcon, IRFC, something, uh, whatever it may be, Ivan is not dependent on the railway infrastructure story. And railway infrastructure story will get intact for the next five years. And along with that benefit, Arvin will also get the benefit from other engineering works from abroad also. It's a very high rate point. So we have to hold the prestigious companies in our portfolio. If we hold Tata Motors, uh, Tata Steel, SBI, Reliance, all the specific company, and this company is included among them. Okay. Rail because Nickel Limited, they are getting orders from abroad because of their quality of execution, executional powers. If a company gets so many orders and if they can't able to execute, or, or if they have no enough money in their hand to execute that orders, they have to take debt. And if it is, uh, and this company can't able to repay that debt, the company will become a debt burden company. This is an example for uh, Punjilaid also. Punjilaid is a very good company. They are getting so many orders, but they can't able to execute order because of uh, lack of money. As well, they take money and they are uh, not able properly uh, re uh, set back the loans also. <coughs> so repay the loans. So in case of RVNL. Execution will be very power and the time of execution is also very important. If, a, if we have taken a contract and, it, if, and we decided to execute within 10 days, it is not possible to execute within 10 days, the, law, the profit the company will get will reduce. 
So Airwheel has the execution, uh, power execution as well as uh, it's a cash rich company to take all these orders and execute it properly within time. So I bet on Airwheel on these purposes and uh, now for the time being we will comparing the valuation PA ratio uh, etc. It is little bit expensive when compared to industrial PE 42.5 cents, it, it has an industrial PE, it has a PE of 55 per 1 inch, it is a little bit higher. But in some cases, we are betting on the future of the company, so this uh, higher PE ratio is not a matter. And present price of 460.70, uh, actually Friday is shows the momentum, if it continues sometime within uh, 10 days or 15 days, it may go to 460 or 470 levels or maybe even, even to 520 levels. After that, it may correct or not. But for the long term basis, it, the, this company is showing consistent profit also. So, we can expect RV will go to 1000 levels in within a period of one year. Other news, and they are getting back to back orders, and all orders are super orders. So, even if the RV is ready for a correction, it will come news that it, the company goes an order of 72 crores. So, the company is going to an order of 100,000 crores. So, this way the company is going, uh, I think there will not be a, a, a correction as expected. On Thursday, there is news that 72 crore order for North Central Railways. In Thursday, they get another order for 156 crore order for from Southern Railways. So, and another news, uh, important news related to railways. Yes, signed, uh, India had signed an MOU with Bangladesh. So, we are expecting more uh, orders from Bangladesh. And the company is, go the company is going to focus more on bullet trains. This all is uh, favorable for the railway sector. And above railway sector, uh, the RVN is very famous for it, uh, its engineering works also. So, I blindly bet on RVNL. So, I don't know whether whether the corruption will come, whatever it may happen, and the ultimate target for tar RVNL will be 1000 rupees uh, within a period of one year. And while considering the momentum on Friday, we can expect the in next week, sometime RML may go to 440-460 level because based on this news, so this is a very good news the, the about the subsidiary of the company, we are going to start in Dubai. So altogether, uh, my favorite stock, I put my, I enhanced my target to 1000 rupees if you are ready to hold this share for the next one year. So as usual, I am not as a bit registered analyst. So please have your own study or consult your own advisor before taking position in the company. If anyone is new to my channel, please subscribe my channel, please forward my videos to friends and relatives, like it. Thank you, thank you very much.